You. You're not from around here, are you? Well, an outsider who's come to join the hunt. What a pathetic idea. You what? What, you think I'm a beast? Well, maybe I think you're a beast. And step away from my castle. He doesn't take nicely to strangers. What about when we talked to him a second time, though? That worked last time. Ah, oh, enough of you. What, you think this is funny? Well, I certainly don't, so be gone with you. I'll have nothing to do with your beast stunts. And t third time? Well, what's this two-bit nonsense you're peddling? I heard you told that wench about some shelter. Well, she's a damn fool to trust an outsider. <laughs> Why? Well, her sort's probably just fixing to feed some of your coin. <laughs> Fourth time? Uh, all right. What crafty lies does the outsider have today? You think I'm an easy mark? Yeah? Well, give me your best shot. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Too sharp for that, bollocks. I know a superstition when I hear one. Outsiders. Even their lies are predictable. <laughs> Again? What? Still prone on folks with your book of lies? Yeah, fine. Come on, show me what you got. Tell me about your little safe place. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Too sharp for that, bollocks. I know a superstition when I hear one. Outsiders. So he doesn't believe either of my options. I wonder if that means that there's going to be a new option. What if I don't tell him? What if I don't tell him? Does he get curious? What? Still... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, afraid your lies will be exposed? Yeah, I knew you'd back off. I just knew it. Yeah, an outsider you may be, but at least you know when you're bested. <laughs> Well, it wouldn't be a Dark Souls game if there wasn't weird ending laughs. Nope, we're done with him. Alright. Any, any follow-up from her? Oh, thank you, darling. Maybe I'll see you there. <laughs> well, hopefully I'm not sending her off to die. My character looks really gross now. Oh well. Let's see more of this shadowy, weird-looking area. Oh, hello, friend. I see you. You're tricking me. I was prepared. I was prepared to go stepping back the moment something like that happened. Can I touch you? Nope. That's a short doorway. Weird. So where is this going to lead to? This doorway is nothing? Oh, hello, friend. Oh, what is that weapon? What is that knife? Oh, you have a friend shooting at you, too. Okay. That didn't work out for me quite. There we go. Success! There you go. For you guys that don't like, that don't think I know how to do that. There's a nice moment. Oh, another doorway that someone lives in. Okay. This guy's trying to shoot me. Ow. Okay, he succeeded. I thought I could pick up the item fast enough without getting hit. Just wait for him to come around. I'll hop straight on him. Oh, shit. There's a guy on the ground here. I didn't even see him. I was a bit distracted. There's an item in the corner. Surgical, ch black church hat, surgical love, long gloves, stuff like that. Take care of this guy. Any surprises around here? I can't see. I can't see crap around here. This would be a good place to ambush me. Oh, they're still trying to shoot me. Probably gonna go do. Oh. Oh wow, that's a very localized amount of smoke. Probably gonna push forward and deal with the guys shooting at me first. Wow, that's a lot of poison knives. They let you carry a lot of those around. All right, I think I'm gonna go up there and fight those guys. Then I'm gonna come back and check out the other doors. There's at least two more behind me. I might go for an even split between the two places I can send people and just... It'll just be luck of the draw. At least I'll save half of them if that's if, if either of them are even safe. Because I don't know. I don't know if I can trust either of these places or if like... Maybe... Maybe tragedy befalls one of them. Maybe putting too many people in one of them attracts beasts and then those people die. Maybe one of them's up to no good and doing evil things. And so sending people there just dooms them. I have no idea. But a lot of these people are probably going to die if I leave them where they are now. Hello, friend. Oh, shit. I fucked that up, apparently. I went for the parry animation, but like, I, I heard the sound, but I didn't really see him assuming the position for it properly. Jesus. There's a lot of you guys around here. Hello, friend. Yeah, there we go. And that's called reloading time. How's that reloading working out for you? Alright, that's, that's the immediate threats taken care of. Lots of quicksilver bullets, more blood vials. We are stocking up on the resources I need. Uh, 
Oh, one of those nasty birds. I know what to deal with him. Hit Hitboxes are amazing. <laughs> Hitboxes are magical things. What's the side of thick blood? Oh. Something could ambush me here because there's a drop off. I'm gonna keep clearing the area real quick. Maybe go up to that doorway I see up top before I go back for, to, for the NPCs. Oh, I can't go there. This is like a, a ladder going somewhere else, it looks like. All right, maybe it's time to just backtrack. We'll check out this ladder soon, but I wanna check, I wanna make sure I don't forget any of these, those NPCs we saw downstairs. What is that guy? He looks nasty. Is that a Cthulhu monster? I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I don't want no Cthulhuies. Cthulhuians. Cthulhuilus. I don't know. I don't know how to, I don't <laughs> What do you call the people of Cthulhu? The Dark? The Abyss? Well, he's dead because hitboxes. I love you, Chain Weapon. I love you so much. Alright, we'll just drop down. There we go. Breaking shit to break my fall. And now we're gonna redo this area. I'm gonna run back a bit, and then we're gonna move forward from where we left off, just to make sure I don't forget anyone. So here's the skeptic guy. Where else can we find... I wonder if he'll give in to peer pressure, like if I get everyone else to go, will he then succumb? Let's see, the doorway here... Okay, here's one of the ones we saw. Ah, uh, oh. Oh, we have the deepest gratitude for the church and all they do for us. Deepest, widest gratitude. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that sounded very sexual in nature. Alright, that's all they have to say. No follow up there. There's another one on my left here. Hello. Hearing some smacking sounds back there. That's not a good sign. <laughs> Praise you! Praise the old damn church! And then the best of luck cuts in! Best luck of all! <laughs> What's going on here? Nope, no follow up there either. First two people actually were willing to talk to me, but these two are both crazy or preoccupied. Maybe they're both too corrupted. Or maybe... Who knows? Who knows what's going on? Anyway, I think it's ladder time. Anything around here? No? Area's pretty cleared. And hey, we're maxed out on blood vials and bullets st still, even though I've been using both. They're just get, they're, we're just getting them faster than we use them. Where's this ladder gonna take me? Besides up, obviously. Yes, I get that much. Joke, in <laughs> joke intercepted. What's down there? That's the courtyard I haven't checked out yet. It's any dangerous stuff here? No? So there's one big guy- two guys walking in circles. So they, they could both be dangerous on their own right. That's where I came in. I went off to this direction instead, instead of going in. I'll definitely want to check it out. The funny thing is, now that they're alive, since they're alive and walking around and being noisy, I can actually use the, like, the stereo effect of, of my uh, headphones to keep track of what direction they are. Which actually gives me a sense of direction as I explore. So there's a central area that's all covered in light. I'll check around first for ambushes of some kind. There's a drop off that's one way, so I'm not coming back up. Oh, what's this? Oh, just notes. A watchman of Birgen, uh, Birgenworth guards the gate with a password. The sacred adage of the Grand Cathedral. A watchman of Birgenworth guards the gate with a password. The sacred adage of the Grand Cathedral. I don't know. I don't know what to make of that. So somewhere that someone needs a password, the sacred dodge of the Grand Cathedral. Is it that gate down there, perhaps? Where is this going to lead to? Probably, I mean, probably a boss fight, inevitably, but also maybe other stuff. And walk, standing here in the middle does nothing. Alright, let's check out my new, my new equipment set. We picked up the... Is the Black Hood part of it? No, Black Church set. Let's, put, let's try the, the church garb. Surgical long gloves. Church trousers dress. Now, now that's what I look like. There's some there's some cool equipment sets in here. So what's the specialty of this stuff? Oops. We'll compare it to the hunter cap, for example. Uh, bonus resistance for frenzy and ble and and uh. Oh wait, no. 
because we started with Hunter Cap, so this is the comparison. Okay, the the church hat gives you higher poison resistance than even than even the set that we were using for poison resistance purposes. Oh wow! So if you came this way first, you'd have a better you'd have better poison resistance for that boss fight. How are the stats looking? Uh, looks like the physical resistances are lower, but the non-physical resistances are higher. Although even the physical resistances aren't that much lower. They're lower than all of my hunter garb options. They're just higher than my starting set at the very least. What's the stuff the equipment say? Attire of healing church hunters. Most healing church hunters are elementary doctors who understand the importance of early prevention of the scourge achieved by disposing of victims and even potential victims before signs of sickness manifest themselves. Their black attire is synonymous with fear and that peculiar Yarnum madness. So they were quote unquote healers of the church because they would kill people who were sick so that other people wouldn't get sick. Anything new here? Uh, attire of the healing church hunters, the holy shawl, symbol of the healing church, flutters proudly on their backs. Most healing church hunters are elementary doctors who understand the importance of early prevention of the scourge. Uh, same... Okay, that's the same text again. Oops. Unequipped it. White surgical gloves, the intricate embroidery, uh, weaves a special... Uh, we, we, we weaves a spell that protects their wearer. The church engages in the hunt in a, uh, medicinal capacity. When a cancer is discovered, one must pinpoint its location, reach in, and retch it from the host's bosom. Breast cancer. Attire of the healing church hunters, the, the, the black church trousers address. Uh, elementary ch doctor, uh, that's the same, just, yeah, it's all the same text again. Alright, let's run around with another set for a little while, just because. Might as well wear some of these new equipment sets when we find them. So I'm gonna go ahead and drop down and see where this takes me. Besides down. Aha, joke intercepted again. I'm on a roll for intercepting jokes that people are not even probably making. So we have the little, yep. Those guys are still down there. Oh, there's two of them and one of them looks different. He's not wearing a hat. I wonder if he's special in some way. And it looks like that's where I, th that's the area I'm circumventing. So looks like that's the linear path to wherever I'm supposed to go next. Probably the next, the, like the direction that leads to the next boss or whatever. And I just did a big circular side path by going that way, which probably gave me new items like these 10 si uh, Quicksilver bullets. That's handy. Anything else around here? So it looks like this whole path's purpose was to give me some bullets, the church attire, and a few NPCs to meet. Because once I drop off this, we're somewhere new. Oh, hello, dog. I see you. You're not surprising me. Can I do a plunging attack? Is that a thing in this game? Yes, it is. I'm always unsure. I, that's the first time I've probably succeeded at one. Thick cold blood. So more, soul, m more uh, blood I can spend without having it disappear when I die. Because I can get it... I can hold on to it for later. Is there a way to open this gate? Closed by device. And this oh, there's the device. Okay. Oh, I see you. Hello, surprise friend. Nope. That's right. I know your attacks are not intercepted, so I'm dodging around you instead. Yep. You're pretty you're pretty easy to fight. You guys are slow. The fire guy was scarier at the very Ooh! Okay, he's got guns! Oh, he's got rapid fire. He's rapid fire shooting me. Oh, we're getting attacked. That guy's got a big ol' hat. Look at that big ol' hat. Look at that big ol' scary hat. I'm gonna hide behind this statue over here, you asshole. Come closer. Oh god, that big guy's coming my way. I'm not cool with that. Alright, let's open this gate in case I get killed here. Please open it without getting shot. Okay. So now at the very least- oh, there's an item here. More blood. Now at the very least the gates opens. Oh, there's another side path. Hey, ow, here. Alright, I'll just go check this guy out then. Hey, buddy. Ow. Give me those hit points back. Give me those hit points back. Before someone kills me. Is this another shortcut I've seen before? Uh, that might not be new either. That might be another not new area. Either way, pull and switches and open and gates so that if I do die, at least I don't have to be on the right side of these gates. That's the guy I killed. Are they pursuing me at all? They're not. Okay. This is another side path of some sort? Oh, that probably leads to that. Or who knows where this ladder goes. Should I go fight these guys? Is there just one? Oh, if there's just one, I'm just gonna wreck his shit. Hey, buddy. Nice to meet you. Ow. I don't play it that way. Hit him back. There we go. Second hit. Where does that lead to? Oh, that probably loops around to the other direction I could have gone from the church in the first place. 
Oh, I just opened a shortcut, probably. Okay, interesting. Wooden oh wooden shield. <laughs> it's the shield that the that that's funny. It's the shield that the enemies have sometimes that's really shitty. They're just I think they're making fun of the shields from the uh, Dark Souls games a little bit. So we'll check out this path. I if I'm right, this loops back to the church. So I just opened the shortcut by going that way around. So if I'd gone this way in the first place, I would have hit a dead end. If I'm careful about this, I can nail this guy. Oh, he's hurt. Why is he hurt? Backstab. Is his, is his friend going to react at all? Or is he just... Oh, oh. I hate you birds so much. The sound you make is the worst thing. Where is this leading to? I'm hoping it leads me back to the church. Because then I have a shortcut. If it's short enough. Hey, buddy. Dodge. Taken care of. I'm getting, I'm pretty on top of this. I'm getting down their uh, animation patterns. So, where is this going to look familiar? Is that an animal? Oh, it's the hunter. That's the hunter we met before. Where does this lead to? Is this where the old lady is? It is. All right. So, yeah. Now, there's my lantern. And as soon as I walk out here and look to the right... There's the uh, shortcut I just opened. So all that crazy stuff I just did, I don't have to do again if I die. Good to know. That's an important shortcut. And this person's just hanging out here. Am I being approached? Is that person on their way over here? I'm gonna take care- there's a, there's a person over here, right? I'm gonna go take care of them real quick, just so they don't sneak up on me while I'm fighting. What are you- OH! Oh shit, you hit hard. Oh, fuck you. Why do you hit so hard? I don't like that at all. Enjoy my surprise. You're on fire. That was not very effective. Pebbles. <laughs> All right, let's try again. Oh, wow. These guys are hard to kill. What's going on there? This guy's scary. Uh, I, I failed at the animation. Quick heal. This guy is genuinely dangerous. Ow. Unsuccessful at shooting him. Quick heal. Yeah. Shit, shit, shit. Well, it's a good thing for the shortcut. That guy's a genuine threat. Holy shit. I wonder if he re continually respawns or if he just shows up once. It's a good thing I opened up those doors. Oh wow, he took all of my souls. Yargul, the Unseen Village. This is a brand new area, okay. What is going on here? So he's, this is a, this is some like, this is like Seath the Scalists type stuff where you, you fight him and you can't quite beat him and he beats you and he imprisons you somewhere. Can I get out? It's not even locked, okay. I had a lot of souls on me. That's kind of a bummer. Can I find him and kill him again? I didn't see this coming. Is that a person? Is he alive? Which way do I go first? That's really unsettling. Oh, his head's in something. I don't think he wanted his head to be in that thing. What do we have around here? I'm gonna go ahead and let's put my lantern on. Hand lantern. Take care. Take out the monocular. <laughs> I don't think I need the uh, the monocular on necessarily. There we go. That'll light us up a bit. Anything cool around here? I think once he got enraged, I would have been better off trying to go for the uh, the. Is this going to be forward progress out of the area? That looks like I'm leaving. I'll check the other the other direction first. Ah uh, man, the funny. Th what sucks is I I successfully rep uh, parried him with my gun. So at that point, if I finished the repost correctly, he'd probably be dead. So I would have nailed it if I had actually hit him. But I, I fucked up the animation. Madman toil uh, surreptitiously in rituals 
to be to back on the moon uncover their secrets there's a weird amount of notes in this game that are just clearly developer messages cause that's not stuff you should be able to write as a uh, player this goes down somewhere too so I have two options to go in no reason to think one or the other one is necessarily a short secret area versus forward progress in the name of the healing church, cleanse us of this horrible dream. 